WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of a very pleasant Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. 11 update, and we've got a mixed bag. The mix goes like this. The Dow's up 143, S&P 12. NASDAQ's off 3. Russell's up 11. Semis are down 67. Tranny's off 75. That is a mixed bag. We got gold off a buck. Silver down 5 cents. Lights recruit up a buck 78. Natural gas off 7 pennies. 30-year treasury printed out at 119.21. That's off 5 ticks. New U.S. dollar index is uh where is it stevie it is up uh, it's down uh, uh 20 ticks uh trading out at 103 17. let's try to figure out what all that means by looking at that nine panel market update chart we begin the upper left hand side the es mini uh price approaching the 4944 level the high so far today is 49 34, 10 points away from that one-to-one -one price projection of its A to B equals CD pattern to the upside. That does not mean that's where price stops. You need to see a bearish reversal candle to confirm at least a short-term top. Spot Volatilix was trading above the 50-day earlier this morning. It is now back below it. It being 1360, watch that close at day's end. Got the NQ. The NQ formed a road's momentum indicator top a couple of days ago, and today it is attempting to form a new profile. So the key levels of support here, 17,351 at the moment, and resistance, 17,683. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar index, it's got that descending trend line resistance, yet prices trade above the top of its daily profile. Overall signal here, neutral. Gold still has an A to B equals CD to the downside, 1986 being the first price projection level. Silver, it's 2134 as its first price projection level. In the case of silver, it's consolidating with inside its profile. If we were to close above the top of the profile, that's at 2321, that would give us a change in trend signal out there, at least a profile change in trend signal, and that may suggest that price would not get down to that A to B equals CD pattern. That's not where we're at as we speak right now. If we take a look at Lights Recruit, it's going to go ahead and complete a TD9 count top today, and it's doing that as price is trading right into that sell zone, the zone of its bearish structured profile between 75.48 and 77.52. Expect that to pull back. If we take a look at natural gas out here, it's testing that key swing point. It was a TD9 count bottom back in December, and the price closes the day below 2.098. That pattern gets negated, and that would suggest that uh, natural gas is going to continue to move lower, likely through the uh, middle of February. But we are getting near the point in time where we certainly want to take a look at long positions inside of natural gas. I just don't think it's here just yet. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Ed Show, but if you're up to start your Friday, please have a fantastic one. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to speaking with you again soon. Take care. Be safe out there.